Trooper Spino was on patrol, driving along I-95 South. He was clocking a vehicle that was speeding. That's when state police say another driver, also speeding, passed the trooper on the right-hand side and got pulled over. Hey, can I just ask you why you're riding their butt like that? You can hear in this YouTube video posted by the account name Civilian on Patrol begin with the driver asking the trooper why he was speeding. I'm running his license plate because everybody yeah. else is speeding. Why are you speeding? Then it appears the trooper noticed marijuana in the car, to which the driver responds. No, I, I have a... Oh, 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 oh yeah, I have a... The trooper explains to the driver he is doing traffic enforcement, especially with the uptick of drivers speeding, and it didn't take long before things escalated. So the f you think you are worried about what I'm doing? State police leaders say they are aware of the video and say the trooper in the video, Matthew Spina, has been with the department close to 20 years now and is overall a good trooper. I was kind of surprised at this. Uh, you know, he's under a lot of stress. It doesn't. That's not an excuse. But, um, you know, it's a little disappointing. As the five minute video continued, the trooper is seen searching the driver's backpack while continuing to yell out his frustrations. It just never ends in this job. I got 14 months. I can't wait to be done. State police say while the department has launched an internal investigation, we revisit everything from the, uh, the cameraman's side to the trooper's side. We look at past performance and we look at you know, all factors involved. In the meantime, the trooper has been taken off patrol duty and the department has also offered him resources. We're going to refer him to uh, get some uh, employees assistance, help him with his stress. Um, we're going to investigate the incident and we're going to make sure that our, our personnel treat the public the right way. State police say this is not a reflection of how they expect their troopers to interact with the public. And they also mentioned they have recently launched a resilience program, which is meant to help their employees deal with this pandemic. Aisha Bo, Fox 61 News. Aisha, thanks.